Hey everyone, this is Magic Lover recording for the MTG Noob. I'm going to be playing a little Legacy one on one action. Playing a uh, Opalescence based deck. Um, well, that's, I guess that's a bit of a misnomer since I've put Opalescence in the sideboard and gone to a main deck, Sacred Mesa uh, win condition. I just think it's a little more consistent without opening up my enchantments to being killed by everything that kills creatures. So, what do we have here? <coughs> Now we got a forest and a crop rotation, so that'll become a sanctum. We got a tutor. And we got a journey in presence, so I think we'll keep it. Up against Minky Boy. I think I've seen him play a couple times. Plays combo. Looks like that's probably what he's playing now. Maybe show and tell. I'm fine leading off with uh, with that into a, you know... Hmm. Oh, that sucks. Huh. Do I rotate here? Actually, I do not. If I rotated there, I'd have... Uh, if, this is, if this is Artifact Prison... Okay. So can't cast anything yet. Gotta get that third land down. I will not be fetching a non-basic. <laughs> this deck plays a lot of wastelands. Expect to see like Metal Worker or Forge Master. There we go. The good news is he's gotta play another okay. So let's get let's get a planes out. Let's get the journey online. Hopefully that was his win condition. He's only got two left. And I've got a pretty full grip. So my next play will be presence, and then hopefully crop rotation one of these planes for a uh, sanctum. Ah, that's a bummer. Oh, God. He's going to have a wasteland lock on me. So I'm going to get one shot with whatever land I pick up. Better make it count, which means I'm going to have to have a lot of Utopia sprawls. Out there. Okay. Hmm. Not what I needed right there. Get presents out. It's unfortunate that he pulled that because I wouldn't have searched for that plains. I would have gotten a forest. That way I could have chained the Utopia Sprawl. Gotten it out a little quicker. That'll work. So whatever he's got left in hand, he can not cast. Uh, yeah. So now it's a race for relevance. What does he pick up? Another Forge Master, okay. God, I hate that. Hmm, that's going to be helpful. Very, very helpful. So, what can we do? Takes three to tutor. And then if I cast, I can tap that for three to cast a Mesa. That'll let me draw something with the trigger on the stack. Can I cast one? Okay, so I'm going to have to remove auto yields. I'm going to try this. Um, okay. 
Okay, now I've got to... I've got to tap this and enlighten Tutor for a journey. I didn't have enough to put the humility, otherwise that would have been the play. I'm going to reveal that. Reveal that. Oh, I've got an extra planes, that's pretty handy. And now I can cast the journey. Oh, it's the extra mana. Crap burgers, I forgot about that. Um, hmm. Yeah, I wasn't really thinking that through. I forgot that that cost three. So sadly, all I did was tip my hand that I've got a journey in nowhere waiting for him. So uh, that is unfortunate. So he is going to snap that sanctum. What I'd really love is an Oblivion Ring to get that Trinisphere. Uh, Hellkite, okay. Here's the funny thing. I could untap, spend three on rotation, kill a planes, get a sanctum, make two guys. And I'm surprised he just didn't go for this, but he probably thinks that's holding me down. So if he's not willing to sack him now, I guess I can just keep making guys to block Hellkite. Can't give a trample. So, let's sack that, get a sanctum, tap it for four. going to sacrifice a Pegasus here. Oh, that was a mistake. Uh, I should have played the forest. Oh, Tran Trinisphere, I keep forgetting. I was going to play the Utopia Sprawl, but that's not going to happen. So this buys me a couple turns. He's going to swing. <coughs> I guess what's saving me is not found a Lightning Greaves, which I'm sure is in his deck. See what he's got. Ugh. Chalice on one is gonna ruin me. Chalice on two is not gonna help. Okay. The good news is this doesn't slow down this engine. Because it's when I cast not resolve, so I'm still gonna cast it. And thankfully, I don't have a lot of two drops. It's going to blank essentially journey and library. Yeah. Uh, what could he do? He could blow up all my one drops? No, I'm still going to chump it. Okay. Does not target. Okay. Got it. So let's get a Utopia Sprawl on there. Get a couple triggers. A couple lands. Well, it's helpful. Uh, what do we want? Uh, take a white. I could really use an O-ring right now. kind of interesting. If I had to O-ring, what would I O-ring? I'd probably O-ring the Trinisphere. Since without that, I can really get going. Because Crucible will at least stop the whole Wasteland thing. Now, he's probably going to get a Blightsteel here, which is unfortunate. Yeah. Okay, I'm dead. Bummer. I 
been killed by this critter a couple times. Ten poisons, uh, enough to seal the deal. So, Journey will come in. That'll come in. He's relatively useless. Um, yeah, because I'll definitely be going on the... Humility moat plan, since he's all, you know, creature-based attack, so... And hopefully we don't get a chalice for one on the opening salvo. Oops. Couple over. Uh, he's got a lot. Nothing he plays is legendary? No. Yeah. Well, it's not gonna hurt. Okay, I guess I don't need one. Meek will come out. Yeah, that's fine. That hurts me more than him, so... This is what I got. <laughs> Two Sanctums and not a green source. Gotta love it. Ah, uh, well, I'm old again. Oh, boy. It's dangerous, but I gotta keep it. The old one-lander, but at least it's got... Something I can cast library with turn two. Come on, Mulligan. He does. Let's see a Mulligan again. No, he keeps still. So we'll get a basic forest, put our Utopia out, pretty standard opening play. And I have no one drop, so if he opens with a chalice on one, I'll be somewhat okay. That's unfortunate. That does help his deck out a lot. Come on, Sanctum. Nope. I'm gonna get greedy. I'm gonna put presents out. I want that extra value card off library. That may have not been the right play, but I need what I can get here. Ugh like that thing. Shroud. That's unfortunate. Five three. Pretty big beat down. Go down to nine. I got two turns. Yeah, doesn't hurt me too much right now. Oh, let me pause for my video card to reset. Okay, let's find me a sanctum that I at least get one untap out of. Ooh, that's gonna help. Of course, not with Trinisphere. Uh, bummer. Hmm. So, get... Another library down. If I if I find an O-ring in here, I'll be okay because I can O-ring Greaves and then journey that because I'll have six mana. Uh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, this is why this deck gets so explosive because with Greaves, now I get to eat Blade Steel quickly. <laughs> Whereas if I could untap, I might have had a shot. Yeah. Mud. It's pretty effective. So, anyway, 
Um, had a chance, but deck's a little too explosive for us, so we uh, gave it a good shot. But uh, Trinosphere, not uh, not my friend. And this guy, probably even less so. So, well, thanks for watching.